<laughs> and we are recorded. Hi, YouTube. Hello. We can't even see my hands. There we go. <laughs> hey. All right. So we're back with a haul video, guys. Yay! The day after yeah. Vogue knitting. Of course, yes, yes. And a crack as well. Right. So, Maria. you guys know me, Maria, aka Baby Joe Crochet. This is my best friend Natalia. Hello. She's like the totally most white girl he's ever met. Yeah, that's probably true. Yep, yep. <laughs> <laughs> so we have a collective haul video from Vogue Knitting. Um, this year I really outdone myself. Out of all the other years, I had an absolute blast um awesome this is yeah. my second time going to vogue knitting my third or fourth I think my fourth fourth. yeah my fourth time going um my camera decided to um die. not die basically <laughs> so we barely got video um footage but we got some awesome photos and that would be like another video with just photos. And I'm learning this new um, program on this laptop my husband got me. And it completely sucks. <laughs> I hate it. I hate the program of this laptop. I think you just froze. I think we should just kind of keep going. Because <laughs> <laughs> it does that. You see why I tell you I hate this the, the program? I hate the program. Yeah. But... Why not just do it straight up, right? Alright, so now, which one we want to start with? Our collective haul together, what we got together, and then what we bought separate individually? Um, let me do it individually and put it all together at the end. Why not? Yeah. So, remember, every year we have a splurge item. I get mine. Yes, I get mine. So we can match them yep. together. Yep. And the guy that we got this from, I think his name was Brian or Dylan. I said it. I didn't find out his name. Yeah, but he was as gay as a picnic basket. <laughs> with tassels everywhere. And then I went traveling to Europe and I woke up in bowl of glitter and feathers and tassels. Yeah. I'm okay. like. What's fun? Yeah. His cashier was hilarious. She looked at him with the. What the? How look? Look. It was too funny, but he was such a sweetheart. <laughs> And this we have is called Vice Hand Dyed for Yarn Lovers. And here's mine. This is this is mine. Yeah. Did you see? Mine is wonderful shade of blue. Why mine look blue? Mine is purple. For some reason it looks blue. Yeah. Ha <laughs> ha, yours looks like mine. <laughs> Whatever, I don't care. <laughs> I don't like blue. I love purple. Purple. <laughs> purple. And my color is called Blur Line Sock Sweet. The right. photos, you will see it better. In the blur Line, both of them Blur Lines. Mine is Sea to Sky. Yours is Blurred Lines. Oh, no. That's weird. No. Lila K. Ombre. There you go. Right. Yeah. This one is called Lila K. Ombre. Yes, yeah, so mine Lila. is the Sea to Sky. Yes, yeah, so Lila K. Ombre. It's just Lilac to whatever Ombre. Yeah. Yeah, but it's purple, and we drop a good forty dollars <laughs> per ball. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, yes, yeah, we did. But it's so worth it. Oh my gosh, and it's one hundred percent. Whoa, and I love it. It's four hundred and fifty yards, one hundred and fifty grams, and it is sock weight, which is a number three yarn. Also known as fingering weight. <laughs> yeah. Fingering weight. Finger. Fingering. Yeah. Fingering weight yarn. And it's 100% wool. Did I say it's 100% wool? Yes, I did. But I love it. I love it. I love it. Oh, my flesh. <laughs> I can't wait to make me something out of this. Oh, and it comes in these cool, awesome. Yeah. Guys. Zebra. Zebra. Okay. Mommy, my, so. my favorite spice girl. Yeah, girl. Now um, I 
This is what I actually did not get last time. <laughs> because it was all sold out. out. <laughs> this is the Bling by Black Sheep and You. Yes. And I have um, mine already. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's, it's 65% Draylon, 31% wool, 4% soft payette, whatever that is. And it's made in Turkey. Made in Turkey. Yep. It's Turkish wool. And mine from Black Sheep and Ooh, since I already had that yarn, like my very first year of Vogue Minis, Black Sheep and Ooh is a very awesome company. I really love their yarns. Um, every year, for four years, I have gone there. Oh, she got yeah, I also needles. got this from Black Sheep and You. This is the size 12 millimeter knitting needles. Mm -hmm. I don't knit yet, but I will soon. Yeah. Yep. Put on a good $5 on these babies. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That is really good. A good price. Um, yeah, so Black Sheep and You is one of my favorite um, stalls and companies there at Vogue Knitting. Every year I go. And I got this one. I'm going to make the cowl. And I got this color because it's completely different. All the other colors made me look too dark or too, you know, whatever. Yeah, yeah. But I love this color. I can't wait to see how it works <laughs> up knitted. This is the Ma 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 Magdalena. Magdalena. Yeah. Hat or cow. So one ball makes either a hat or a cow. Um, and this is 53% wool. And 47% acrylic. And it's Italian. Yes. And it's made in Italy. So, oh, sorry. And it's made in Italy. I and what I fun. love is that they have the labels and the where it's made, the yarn, the fiber content, and also when you open up the label, it has the pattern for either the cow or the and hat. Written on the. Written on the label. And it is totally awesome because you can keep it, you can store it really good. And the, and the lady, she was so happy to see me. She was like, oh my god, you're here again. <laughs> Apparently, <laughs> this one here is famous from Black Sheep and You. And she is on their website. So once I get home, I'm going to check that out and see if it's true. <laughs> she was like, oh my god, I remember you. I remember you. You're on our website. You're famous. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> And I was walking around somewhere, so I actually did not hear that part. That was kind of upsetting, because that would have been so funny to hear. <laughs> Janet was dying in that <laughs> She seems like, yeah, who, whoever will ever would Maria go that she is not famous. <laughs> oh, you want to talk about that awesome bookstore? That book stall? Yes, I get your book. Yeah, if you talk about, oh, you get your book. You chose to get the, um... Okay, so... There was this awesome stall that is called Listen While You Knit. And they give us this awesome booklet with and they beautiful knitting patterns. Right. You didn't check the book? Mm -hmm. I got the book, but they also, um, they gave like this little card. Oh, yeah. And it has a, um, a free audio book that you can listen oh. to, and then it gives you samples. Right. I think, yeah, this is it. Yes. yes. So these are the people here. There's yeah. someone in it. And yes, it gives you a free book. And then like and four or five samples. samples at the back of listening. And they tell you to spin this big wheel. And guess who won the opportunity to choose whatever she wants in the stall? <laughs> and me, I'm the one who noticed this. And I saw and <laughs> got it upside down. <laughs> right in front of her. I said, here, you want this. And yes, she did. Oh, and yeah. she took it. Yep, yep, yep. Um, actually, I have all three of these books that I have I started to read. <laughs> and sometimes it's hard when, like, with me, who works in a craft store, I'm always constantly crafting and knitting and crocheting and teaching it. It's kind of hard to continue read. my love for books. <laughs> I love books. So... I got my first ever audio book. It's 15 compact discs, 20 hours. So that means it is the entire Higher series. series. <laughs> All three books. And um, it's originally $50 US mm -hmm. for the whole compact. Yeah, and this one, they also had a lot by Debbie McComber. And they also had, like, books. Mm -hmm. um, oh, well, like, yeah, yeah like a couple out. of novels. But I definitely we will check them out because... Yeah, you got the the little knockoff little 
<laughs> you got a cute little bag though, cause I was I looking at the little yeah. bag mm-hmm. and I had no clue so, that this is what I got her this. Yeah. That is so it's cool. A cute little bag, and here's my book and my card that are actually inside here. I just put them yeah. in one time. I didn't have the luxury of getting a bag to drop my stuff in mm. because I'm pretty I sure wanted you book. wanted a bag instead of Fifty Shades of Grey. <laughs> I probably would have taken the bag. Okay. So beads. If you want to do your beads, mm-hmm. you're gonna show your beads. Now, last year I did not stop at the bead place and get something because I knew I'd stay there for a while and yeah, spend me. more money. Mm-hmm. This time I managed to ring myself in. I only got one set of beads. This is what I got. So they're purple and they're kind of like pearlized. So I was instantly drawn to them. So and the stall is a uh, bead biz. So, I'm going to check them out at some point once I'm actually good at beading. Yeah. So. Um, this is mine. I got mine also from there. Um, mm-hmm. I actually minimized my style because I have so much beads to crochet and knit with. But I got these. I totally think they're awesome. They're different from the color code because I have so much purple. Like no one's business and this year I tried my best not to go purple crazy but (sighs) purple runs through my blood but I'm glad I didn't get purple bees because I had abundance of purple bees and I just thought these black ones was totally beautiful and the lady she was so nice she was so so nice but definitely we will be ordering bees from her online definitely definitely Needs money flowing regularly. Yep. A girl needs to save because um, uh, my how my paycheck went. Both many times. Yeah, yeah, a lot of mine too. A lot of well, both of our paychecks. We 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 um, we went poll. <laughs> our yeah. paycheck. We definitely brought a lot, a, a, a lot, lot, a lot more, more than last year. Yeah. No. I'm so glad that I'm working for this year for <laughs> mm-hmm. I got whatever I want without restraint. <laughs> Sorry, oh my gosh. Oh, we got more yarn. More yarn. We got a lot more yarn. Guys, if you see me looking down, oh, it's I got this big heavy bag. If you start oh, about Lion Brand stuff, yeah. Oh, speaking, of, you want to start about you want to talk about Lion Brand? Oh, sure. Since we show the Lion Brand bag, why not? Yeah. So we get to Lion Brand store, and you, Maria, she just like freezes in the track, stops talking, <laughs> and she's like, "Is that Lily Chen? Is that Lily Chen?" And <laughs> yes, it was, it was Lily, Lily, Lily Chen. No, at this point, I did not know who she was. So I'm just standing there like, okay, who is she? <laughs> well, okay. <laughs> Lily Shen is the Guinness World Record World's Fastest Crochet. And she, most of the design books, I have one design book with um, Tunisian crochet. She is a titan in the crochet world. I really, really love her work. I admire her personality. She is like one of the sweetest people I've ever met in person to date. Everyone I've ever met that wrote, has written and designed in any of these crochet and knit books. Down from Nikki Espin, I met her. I've met Nao Lily Shen, Rita Lees, um, Margaret Hubert, Edie Ekman. Who else has met? I met one. Tatiana, Jenny King, <laughs> all of these fabulous and then there was this guy that runs the knits also. I forgot his name. Oh my gosh. I met him at Lion Brand. He finger knits. See, this was his fingers. And he taught me how to knit with my fingers. It was so sweet. Sweet, sweet awesome. guy. Yeah. And I, we collectively bought her mm-hmm. knitter's toolbox. And it's autographed to both to Maria and Natalia. Lily Shen. Um, it says, enjoy, Lily Shen. Um... I should have slid the paper out and have her sign the paper and then slide it back in, but she signed the plastic. plastic. So it's going to it, it, rub off. Probably, but we're trying If to anyone has any hints for maybe how to keep, keep it, it from 
rubbing off. We're open to suggestions. suggestions. Yep, yep. And we will try to um, not use this case for the books. We were going to change the complete case and just yes. frame, put this in a box frame. Maybe. Uh, yeah, we think we should put it in a box frame, in a picture frame that you could fit something inside and close it so that no one will mm. touch it. Maybe. Yeah, we might just do that just so that we have it. And um, she also autographed um, is it some fun? Huh? Um, do you have yours? I think I have mine here. Mine is somewhere. I think it's in my other bag. Ooh, because I have a I bunch have of bags. I have so much. <laughs> we have. We, a we lot definitely of got a bunch oh. of book business cards and books. You can show them they're free. Okay. So from Lime Brand, this is the Nine Fast Knit Fashions. These cover there. A lot of cool stuff. Mm -hmm. And let's see. Mm -hmm. This one, Ten Kids Bright Knit and Crochet. And this one, Tell Family Holiday Knit. I'm probably going to be looking more into this one for holidays. Okay, how do you think? Yeah. I know Fine. I have it here somewhere. Yeah. Oh. I, I had her sign mine too, but she made a mistake on mine, like crossed it off and wrote my name again. But she's actually really good yeah, at remembering your names. names. And styling it too. Yeah. Because when I was younger, that was the main problem I had. People could not spell my name and they called me Natalie and I used to get really <laughs> mad at that. Yeah. The the only thing I used to hate when people do is add a S onto my last name before I got my my middle name was Daniel and they always just say hi Miss Daniels and I'm like Daniel no S <laughs> I'm so serious I used to do that a lot and <laughs> that will totally ruin your experience with me I'm like my name is Daniel do you see an S on my name no then why are you adding an S well this is what she signed. Mm -hmm. To Maria, hi Maria Lidishin. Um yeah. and at the back has a five dollar off coupon. coupon for Annie's online classes and it expires at the end of this year, December thirty first. So definitely I will be using the coupon and this will be being framed with this. <laughs> I'm gonna stick them together and frame them or frame them separately. Um yeah. What else do you want to talk about? Well, there's actually this one stall. Actually, it, like, was, it was two people at that stall. I don't know where the other one is. But I actually got this really oh, oh. cute... Oh, oh. Stop. You have cute to put your hand at the back so we can see it like that. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I'm sorry. I'm new to this. Yeah. The, the girl who makes this, her name is Marsha... Uh, I don't know if it's August or Augusta. Margus Augusti. Augusti. Yeah, but she has an Etsy shop called Midnight Scribbles. But her name is that she has one geek to craft them all. It's really awesome. She, she's a, she's she adorable. Is, she actually reminds me of my little cousin who yeah. happens to be taller than me, like about the same build. Yeah. Yeah. And so she probably does maybe about ten sets and of these a, a night. And like yeah. her sets are usually like five or six. Yeah. This one is mine. Mine is blue. Yeah, mine's actually the green one. Not blue this time. Mine is blue because, and it's a yin and yang. I love it because it reminds me of the ocean back home in Barbados. The ocean. I miss the ocean so much. I just want to jump in Barbados, clean blue waters, and drink the sea water. <laughs> yeah. I really but do this the is, island. Yeah. But this is it. I totally, absolutely love it. Yeah. So these are gonna be all photographed and put as a another little something. And, and, it, and there was the also the little package, package who was right next to her. I don't. I put the card somewhere in the bag, and I got oh, this oh, oh, I think gorgeous. I it's like a purple, pink, gray mix. And the name of this one is the merino wool. It's hand painted. Mm -hmm. Right. So this one is. Koigu Painters Palette Premium Merino Wool, 100% wool, and this is the 50 grams, so it's 157 yards. Wow. Right. Yeah. And I also got from that same stall this awesome knit pattern. I paid five dollars for it. Um, this is a beautiful shawl. If you have actually seen this in person, you would spend the five dollars and get the um the pattern too. Yeah, it's it a beautiful. knitted pattern. Um, 
and basically she said because I know how to knit feather and fans and make um, lace knitting it should be easy for me to do um, but she was so so nice and you remember Janet said that she remembered the lady from some place mm -hmm. she actually texted me this morning and said yes that because she's a big Yankees fan that that's how she remembered her face because she follows her on um, Twitter I think or on Instagram so hi hi Yankee lady we love you you were so nice to us at your stall and you're awesome I really love your vibe <laughs> yeah. can we go upstairs now um, I think we we done with downstairs, right? Yeah, that's all the stuff we got from, from downstairs. downstairs. <laughs> yes, downstairs. Actually, the this one was from upstairs too. Right? Yeah, the bag and the, bag the audio, audio book books was upstairs. upstairs. But that's twenty minutes of downstairs. Damn! Imagine <laughs> upstairs. <laughs> now upstairs is wonderful woman mm -hmm. who hers is just amazing stuff so. that she made, and she was wearing these gloves that have like. Dragon, dragon skin, skin. Dragon, dragon scales. Yeah, scales. But she also had an egg that she made, Wait. and we bought the pattern. Yay! Yep. That's yeah. that. And so with this, the pattern alone was what five five, five dollars, and then said so the pattern for to make the egg takes two bags of scales. Scale. Hers is blue, mine is purple, because I want a big yeah. purple scaled egg. Yeah, and so the sources for the dragon scale, like if anybody wants to buy, you can get it from colettesgarden.com. That's C-O-L-E-T-T-E-S garden.com. The C and the G are capital. Or you can visit their Etsy shop at www.etsy.com slash shop slash art by Colette. C O L E T T E, and they are amazing. This lady is so nice. She is so yeah, amazing. So sweet. And I also got one more thing from her. Actually, she had given us these awesome stress balls. Yeah. Yeah. I got two because I'm highly stressed. Again, <laughs> blue. I got orange and clear with stars in it because yeah. we're stars. Yeah. So they give you these to work out and your wrist before you knit, before and after you knit and crochet is really mm. good. I also bought yeah. a little, uh, well, I'm going to use mine as a zipper pull. Mm. I think I use, I have bought one more thing from her or was it from another lady? From her. Yeah, it's from one. her. This one is mine. I bought this to wear the zipper pull because my jacket needs one. Yeah, and I got this beautiful, you can use it as a key ring or not, and I think this is real granite, purple mm -hmm. granite. And it's a butterfly. I absolutely, absolutely love it. Um, it's a real, real, very real semi-precious stone. And it's a key ring, or you can use it as a stitch marker. I think I'm going to use mine as a stitch marker because I keep my stitch markers way better than I do keep my key rings. Yes. This yeah. Is so this will be like for my expensive yarns that my projects that I will only keep at home. <laughs> yeah. You think yeah. you have the, the one about the um the gallery. Oh, the it's down here. It's right here. Yeah. There's a gallery. Uh, I'm a Garumi gallery. Yeah, so this exhibition is going on. It already started. It started on December 12th. It's going until February 28th. 28th. Yeah, so that we're definitely going. It's so funny because I saw the guy, they have like the samples the sample on the I'm table, going. and I was like, we're going to this, like I picked up the cards and everything, and the guy's like, oh yeah, come, we have this, we have this, I was like, you don't have to sell it, we're coming. Okay. <laughs> we're <laughs> coming. Yes. Yeah. It said at Resto Box Gallery in the city, so it's Ooh. close to home, so we're definitely going. going. Yep. Um, also, um, I stopped by at the Crochet Guild and Knitters Guild of America. Um, I think I'm going to be joining their, um, their community. Lily Shin actually invited me to one of their meetings, so I will be going to the Crocheters and Knitters, the Knitters Guild meeting, mm -hmm. and I will go to one of the meetings of the Crocheters mm -hmm. Guild. 
and I probably I I'm gonna see how it is, and I my, I I definitely feel I'm gonna join the Knitters and Crochet Guild. It's thirty dollars for a year a membership, okay. which is really good. So I'll go. I'll probably join for the year. You get to meet even more crochet designers who are in the books. Um, discounts you get absolutely discounts to every single yarn store that requires the crochet guild. So that'll be like more yarn for me. Yeah. <laughs> even more yarn to go in your wonderful chest. Yep, my chest is packed to maximum. I gotta kick out some yarn and put even more. Mm -hmm. on. Actually, I should stop saying kick out. I should just make the stuff in the in the chest. Yeah, just use something. Yeah, I should. I have my all of my one of a kind only for moi. <laughs> Yes. If you're uh, if if you get a a crappy gift from me that's not made out of the expensive yarn that I've done, let's just know that you didn't make it to my list uh -oh. this Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> Ouch. Oh, I get something special. You will. I mean you got yarn from my chef. Yes you did. I, did. I mean I can't believe I actually get that person some yarn from my chef. Because he deserved it. I mean, I'm sorry. He he really did. Um, I'm not going to call his name, though. No. no. I still want to keep my friendship, and I don't think I should be getting hung right about now. <laughs> I love my life. <laughs> There's also this song. What's in the sister? Oh, I think I have their car here. They're called Stitch Sisters. Stitch Sisters. Yep. They're totally awesome. And we got the same color yarn because yes. it matches our skin tone. We got Vivo Denso's, this bright one here. And Vivo then the pastel. light one. Yeah, it's pastel. pastel. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yeah, the pastel. And each one of these were actually $5. <laughs> yep, yeah, $5 per ball. Right. And then I also got this ripple one here. It's very similar to Red Heart's rib, uh, Boutique Ribbon, which is actually why I picked it up. And she said, this was also five dollars, and the reason why they sold it for five was because Red Heart gave them that discount. Oh wow! She said since they passed on the discount, wonderful woman. Yeah. Yes. And then um, also, also from their shop, I I got the darker she bought purple. Hers. I, mine was given to me for free. <laughs> yes, these are the fifty, 50 grams. grams. These are actually big in Russia. Russia. Yeah, yes. it's very big in Russia. It's one hundred percent merino wool. It's 50 grams, 295 yards. Um, and this is a number two fine yarn. Yours is, yeah, is yeah. a number two fine. You have the thick, you also bought the thicker one. You, no, I didn't get the thicker oh, you didn't one. Get it? Oh, I was okay. contemplating the wool or the merino. Mm -hmm. And because I kind of took a little long because I had a wool, I have a wool cowl already from Universal Yarns, 100% wool, also that I got from Vogue Knitting last year. When mm -hmm. I bought that book, those two books by Nikki Epstein, and um, mm -hmm. yeah, so it didn't make any sense having another wool, um, cow. Yeah. But I really loved that one, and I, that pattern was perfect for that yarn. <laughs> but I just fell in love with this one, the yeah, light so that's purple. That's the end of my shopping. Um, well, I still got more. <laughs> I still got more. Um, oh. Speaking of Nikki Espen, I bought this knit book. I think it was it's nineteen ninety five dollars US, and we got how much for twenty percent off. Right. Twenty percent off, so I paid like fourteen dollars and some change, mm. and it was pre signed. It was pre signed by Nikki Espen herself. It's so funny because you were telling the guy that you had met her before last year. And you were just commenting. Right. He's like, oh, really? Well, is Laura here? Yeah. He's like, she knew, she knew you were coming. coming, and it was the last book, <laughs> the last one, <laughs> the too. last book. Um, I think I have like two more charms. I I have the charms there. Oh, we could go ahead with. Oh, no, not only the, this company. That's the same one where we bought the the first one we showed you, the forty dollar one. Yeah, it was at the same store. Yeah, and um. So we yes, asked so. her, you know, how much for this book. It's free with the purchase, purchase of that, that specific yarn. Yes, the Zilla yarn. 
Yeah. Just be lying on yarn. And the funny thing is, we were finished yeah. shopping. Yeah, we're in the lobby just relaxing because, you know, we've been all over the place, tired. It was her who put it out, right? Yeah, it was the same she comes with put a it out. She comes with a stack of pull. these books and just puts it on the table down. and walks away. Like, seriously, you just told us we like couldn't get again. one unless we bought the yarn. Yeah, but um, yeah. So, guess what? We got your book. Right. <laughs> you left them on the table and walked away. When the Actually, they were for the people to just take them. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. That sucks. But they should do at the end. Like, once... The, that's why we go on the last day, because when you go close to like, closing time, when it's all done, they're People like, we don't need this, this anymore. <laughs> you can take this. We don't that. need this yarn anymore. You can have yeah. it. You got a we don't need this needle, needle, needle and crochet hook, too. Yeah. yeah. Um, the New York, oh, this is um the, from the Crochet Guild, the events and meetup list from the Crochet yeah. Guild. Then um we were talking to this beautiful lady and her oh, awesome husband. Good that had these bowls. I have one more thing. You got one more thing? Right, so we were talking about to this beautiful lady and her awesome husband and they have these yarn bowls. And I was like, ooh, I would so love to have a yarn bowl in purple and purple wood. Um, And I asked him if he would make it for me and stain it purple. He's like, no, there's actually a purple heart. And he said it's purple heart wood. Yeah, I think that's right. what he said. Right, and um, oh, someone actually it. stole it from Vogue and, Nenin. And it was one that was already and pre-ordered, pre-ordered, and someone had already, I think, paid I mean, for even it. before the day, they said they were doing yeah. inventory that morning, and they realized it was gone. Now, I, we go to the yeah. vintage Shame button. Shame on you place. who stole that Vogue. The vintage button. Oh, yes. oh my god. Half the price what I paid last time. If you still like this bit of shimmer blue in it. Yeah. Yeah. So I couldn't put it down. How much you paid for your button last year again? Thirty. Shame on you. Listen, it was a geisha, <laughs> okay? And I have the pattern that I want to use it for. All I have to do is get the yarn. Okay. okay. Um, my button is here somewhere. <laughs> I have gotten a button. Um. Oh, you can talk about Clover. Oh yes, Clover. We love Clover brand. I I love their elastic yarn. I used it to make a bridal garter for my friend's wedding. Yes, and I wanted that yarn cutter that looks like a awesome little um, like a key ring in a little circle. No one would even know that it has a blade in it. You just slide the yarn right between the slip, and it cuts it. And they were just advertising. What I, I mean, they had this whole bunch of stuff. We're like, ooh, ooh we're gonna we're buy this, this and we'll buy that. So and no, we're not selling. selling. <laughs> just a distributor. Yeah, but the guy, he was nice enough to give me this. But mm-hmm. it was came in a bag, and he gives me a pair of knitting needles and circular knitting needles, and um, what else? A small little catalog. These ones are the number eight five millimeter knitting needles. Um, how long is it? Nine inches? Yeah. Nine inches. And he got me he gives me a number nine, twenty nine inches, seventy four seventy four centimeters circular knitting needle. So I got this for free also. So I got like two things for free. At Vogue Knitting. Yeah, he. I had a this awesome button. I can't find my button. Oh, I my wanted your bag from somewhere. Oh yeah. And all that stuff. So, hold on. I think it oh. might be in my handbag. Oh, she might yeah. have found it. But yeah. So at the end of the day, we went to. I don't even know how to pronounce the place. It's a. It's A J I S A I. For we went for sushi. Food is really good, delicious. Just a little note though, so it was four of us, and we got fifteen dollars in gratuity alone. But so that was a big disappointment. But the food was delicious. And we had soup, salad, and we went. It was about three thirty, and apparently their lunch time ends at four. So we got the lunch meal. Yeah. Find it. 
It might be in here. Oh, I got that one on my free hand. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> she got a free hand for the crochet and the green girl. Like, oh. <laughs> Not that I know she had this, but, you know. Oh, sorry. <laughs> yeah, because I stopped to look at the looms. I was just the same time when I went and got my the first little charm, but the girl who reminded me of my cousin. Oh wow! Yeah, she was really a yeah. sweetheart. I really, really liked her. Yeah, it looks like this. Like she oh, started it as her here. hobby. It's so. on the floor. Uh, Found it. Found it. Yeah. So, so last Lots year, that's to her. Last year, I bought my buttons. They were medieval from the 18th century. Yeah. Yeah, because no, all these buttons are older than us. Um, they they were older like than when they were older than when our parents' grandparents were swimming in their nut sacks. Yeah, she's been saying that since. I love the nut sack. I don't know. Why. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh, and I got this button. I just totally love it. It's so. It has grooves in it. Yes, it's groovy. groovy. I think I have the perfect project to use this button. Um, and I got it for a dollar. I think this is from the... You got that for one dollar? Yes, I did. I didn't know that. I didn't tell you. No, you didn't. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> it's for a dollar. And it's um, so funny because the woman remembered us from last year. Yeah. Because I... <laughs> that button that cost me $30, I wasn't sure if I was actually going to get it because $30 is a lot wow, of money, money for a button. Yeah. And I walked back to the place like three or four times oh. until I finally just said, I'll just take okay, the button. Fine. They actually remember this. And one of the women was sitting down. She's like, are you wearing heels? You seem taller this time. Mm -hmm. That's actually funny because my boots were heels. Yeah. I was like, yeah. And, and then the funny thing is, too, she asked me, so did you use your medieval buttons? I'm like, no. <laughs> She's like, then which means you girls need to just buy our buttons and just have a vintage button collection and yeah. just collect. Yeah, I'll do it. I mean, it's like, my mom has a buttons collection. She has a stamp collection, coin collection. Mm. But I'm like... My grandmother used to collect the quarters. Mm. My mom still got buttons that she collected from when she was a little kid. Around my age. Yes, mom, I'm saying it. You're old. <laughs> and I know you're going to watch my video. No, I did not say it. <laughs> you're old. Yes. <laughs> My mom is gonna kill me <laughs> if she sees me. <laughs> I'm gonna have to cut that part out. <laughs> I'm Just cut. remember, you have so much fun with us, mom. Yes, remember the good times. <laughs> My mom said, "Yeah, I remember the good times, pushing you off the cliff." <laughs> <sighs> yeah. So I think I think that's, that's it. That's it. Unless you want to talk about your free yarn. Oh, you mean that little run? Okay, this is completely random. If this was just laying there on on the table, just random. I wanted to take one of those balls too. That were in yeah, the bowls. bowls. But oh. then it's so funny because the woman's man's wife was there. Was we there. didn't even know oh. until afterwards. <laughs> we yeah. were like, "Are we gonna take the yarn?" Can we take the yarn? Can we take the knitted needles? Oh, and they're the knitted needles so cute. I know they're like oh wooden God. and they're like so tiny. Yeah, they're adorable. And they had like natural colors like blue and purple. Yeah, really nice. And the red. It was really nice. But you know what I want to get next year? That will, I think it would be my swish. That um, giant size. Oh no, I got that oh, giant speaking size of which, and it needles already. They had this giant crochet hook. It's so big. It was uh, well, like a 120. It it's so like big. It's not even on the alphabet scale anymore. Yep. I mean, it looked like huge. a giant prehistoric dildo. It did. It did look like a penis. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie. But then there's <laughs> also the guy with the pillow. It's like a massage pillow. pillow. You just lean back on it, and it go. Uh, Feel really good. good. Yeah, really good. We were tempted to buy it, but it would have been like thirty-five dollars each. Each, but he said online they used up about seventy. Mm -hmm. So he said like he would have given us like a buy two, one get, get one free. free deal. Yeah, but thirty-five dollars is a lot for a pillow. Exactly. Although we probably should have gotten, gotten it. it. I would have gotten mine in a zebra print, just to go back, just to match back with my snuggie. I would have just gotten the blue one because my snuggie is actually blue. 
Yeah. And that was given to me. I did not buy it myself. Mine was given to me till my husband got me a pr- uh, that zebra print snuggie. I love my snuggie. Because, I mean, when you're sitting there tired, and you got your snuggie on you, and your pillow, and you, and all of a sudden Bruno Mars playing your mm, head. Bruno. Today I don't feel like doing anything. Da-na-na. I just want to lay in my bed. And we've been doing that all day yesterday, too, just singing. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the outfit she's wearing is that these overalls and this cap. She's wearing her cap backwards. For yeah. some reason, I turn around and look at her, <laughs> and the Fresh Prince theme song is like popped into my head. And stupidly start singing. So we're singing on the elevator, elevator. escalator. Uh, escalator. We didn't like the elevators. Going, we're coming, going up. We're going, we're going up. up. We're going and up. This, and we get off the escalator, and this guy, he just starts we're singing, singing with, with us. us. Only mm-hmm. in New York, we have like the fun people who everyone thinks are crazy because they're not uh, from, from New, New York. York. Yeah. But when you're in, in New York, that stuff happens all the time. Like earlier when we were walking to the Marriott, we, we started singing, singing Little, Little Mermaid, Mermaid. <laughs> <laughs> because there we happened to pass Toys R Us. Sitting, sitting there across the way, she ain't got a lot to say, but there's something about her. Yeah, and this, I think it was a lady that ran in and said, "Do she wanna kiss me, girl?" <laughs> I actually didn't hear what she said. We were um, done. I heard it. She said it right. She came up next to me and said it. Whoops. Phone. This money, honey. <laughs> Sorry, Ooh. husband calling. Yo, yeah. I'm doing a video. Don't yeah, it. So it, was a, it was a really fun fun day. It also yeah. happened one more time. And then afterwards we went to Junior's and got cheesecake. So, yeah. Yeah. And then we went back to Marriott to sit down and eat. Yeah, we had yeah. our cheesecake while they're cleaning up everything and we're just sitting mm-hmm. there. They're fast, so they're like Shady yeah. Gonzalez pulling that stuff no. down. It was kind of cool. We just sat there, we were like, oh. we're so tired. <laughs> yeah. And no one came and bothered us. Except for my friend, she said that when she got up, mm-hmm. there was a guard who was coming towards us. And then as soon as she stood up, like he turned and walked away. Maybe he was coming to tell us that we needed to leave, but we're leaving anyway. I mean, we just yeah, sat there and ate cheesecake. cheesecake. We weren't doing anything to anybody. So. Yeah, and some of the designers came out like, oh my gosh, that looks so good. We were like, shooting We even saw the crazy guy who we brought the $40 yarf run from. Oh, the guy with all that tassels? Yeah. Oh, he, he walked past. He had a gear than a picnic basket. <laughs> but I loved it. He was awesome. He was awesome. He was so awesome. And, oh, you remember his cow that he had on with, with the... It had a cassette tape. tape. <laughs> <laughs> it was hilarious. Yeah. And he was like, jean And we saw this woman with, like, clear boots. Oh, yeah. those. And we would just pin those on our yeah, pizza yeah. page. Yeah. If you like our um, sense of humor, you can go and like our Pinterest page called I Dare You To Make Me yeah. Laugh. I started it, and I said, listen, I know you, so you're allowed to pin to it. <laughs> And have a couple other of my friends, and she pins the most. Because <laughs> I'm the most insulting it's just, all of the friends. It's just hilarious, all this stuff that goes up there. <laughs> we even have one from a family feud with Steve Harvey. Yeah. That one's hilarious. That one's so funny. Uh, what, what, um, what do you call it? Um, oh, gosh. Uh-huh. Well, lying. Which one goes that well, lying? Well, pork. <laughs> pork, you <pie. laughs> <laughs> no, someone actually said that he goes with pork, you and they said coupon. <laughs> I was like, oh my god. Oh, that was That's so funny. Do. I, oh, I can't, I can't. Yeah, just go online and like it. Yeah. Yeah. Our lighting sucks. Hopefully next time we will have our totally awesome good lighting. And, um, who knows, maybe next time we'll do it at my house. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to come to your next to door and hope I ain't going to get shot, you know. She lives in the rough part of East New York. You will not get shot. And there I hasn't been shot out there since the guy in the uh, building, the one who actually didn't do anything in the pink houses. Oh, the one that was on the news? Wow, so sad. Yeah. But that's yeah. that's a good, like, that's not close to me. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. But I live in a nice East New York area. Can I say? Anyway. Yep. Yeah. So I'm kicking this one out of my house. I know. Right about now. I guess we go. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah. And this is fun. I've never yeah. done a, a vid- YouTube video other than the one with my cat falling off the bed. <laughs> yeah. And stay tuned because I'll be taking photos of my stuff. 
and she'll be taking photos of her stuff and emailing it to me and okay I guess I have a job to do I, yes you do <laughs> and that way we could upload just a random video of photos um what and any photos maybe I'll put the ones like you and Lily Chin and yeah I like have all a, the amazing I stuff that we're we, that we women who crocheted free. food and, and it's like an open fridge and I mean seriously mm-hmm. I looked at it and I said lunch <laughs> remember this year's theme was for women it was the seven wonders yes they had all this seven wonders crocheted crocheted and knitted I've actually been to one of those wonders <laughs> Great Wall of China it took a guy nine months to walk the whole thing because they actually let a guy do it. But you have to get permission. Oh, you do? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, so that's what I've been doing. And just know it's... You you work out your legs a lot, especially on the stairs to start. Oh, they don't tell you how many stairs it is to get up there. And it's all man-made, so they're not even. Um, oh. I mean, I'm not afraid of heights, but coming back down, I was... And then, like, it's like little... All the little, like, stores and stuff. Mm-hmm. Two little steps, and I had a hard time walking up those. Because my legs were just shaking so much from coming <laughs> down. <laughs> but yeah. China was wonderful. I'm afraid of heights. But I... So I, definitely, like, when we first got on... When we first got there, silly us. And when you get there, you're supposed to punch in the floor that you're going to, and it tells you which elevator. elevator. We didn't do that. We got into the first one that opened. <laughs> It took us all the way to the 37th floor, and those elevators are fast, and, like, you feel, like, the inertia uh-huh. and all that. And they're see-through. Yes, it's glass. <laughs> so. It's see-through. Yeah. Let's just say, a girl was not happy <laughs> at <It> all. Was <laughs> <laughs> I was not happy. Stephanie was not. Stephanie hid her face in the corner. <laughs> I actually did not. I was so busy looking out, I didn't see her. <laughs> I I they I stupid me because I'm afraid of heights. Just wanted to get Stephanie to look and to cry. I simply said, "Oh look, I'm looking down. I'm looking down." And Stephanie said, "No, don't look down. No, don't look down." <laughs> that was so funny. <laughs> it was a really good day. Then we walked around Times Square. Yeah, we ended up in this cool fat shop. <laughs> I wasn't gonna mention that, but hey, I don't care. It's my video. If somebody get offended at tearing about our little. Manhattan exhibition of walking to a set shop. I'm married and I don't care. <laughs> yeah, that was that was. A, a, we're not gonna go into details. We just wandered into a set shop. <laughs> I know we did not buy anything. No, we did not. Well, no, we did not. Yeah, um, we were more. Um, we're just walking around just to do stuff. Yeah, killing time. Yeah. Oh, that homeless guy with the apple. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I don't know, like, he had some stuff that was harassing <laughs> some apple He harassed corn. me for, like, how many, like, five different times? He kept walking back to you, even after you, like, can you please just get away? away from he me. came back. I asked him politely, I said, can you please go away? Like, can yeah. you get out of my face? And he has the apple, like, you want the apple, the, the core, like, the apple. Some of it. No, the whole run, he ate around the whole apple, and he's like, you want the core if the apple is very good. I'm like, um... No. No. <laughs> Get away from me. And they, like, he got me so mad. You, you remember what I told him? Why don't she just eat a handful of apple seeds and die? And that was just wrong what I told him. But I'm like, gosh, this is the fifth time I'm telling you to go away from me, to leave me alone. And I'm wet. It was raining I'm, all, all day. day. I'm wet. I'm cold. I'm tired. Right. We no, your belly was full. I mean, we just ate, so you're feeling stuffed. Yeah. Yeah. I I was getting the itis, and walking with the itis is not a good thing. Yeah. But I was just miserable, and tired, <laughs> and wet, and cold. Oh, and yeah, the cold. last thing I need is he <laughs> smelled <laughs> like <laughs> alcohol. Mm-hmm. Like I didn't smell. Him. He didn't alcohol. come close enough to me for me to smell him. But. Because you were all on the other end. You were right in the middle, and as soon as he come around, you just stepped away and left me there standing. I was born in New York. Stuff. I know these people. <laughs> like, if you get too close to them, you never get them away. <laughs> <laughs> you just completely left me there. I hate you. I didn't completely leave you. I'm trying to pull you away this way into a conversation about what to do next. Yeah. 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 Anyhow, I gotta go because my little munchkin, as you can see, just yep, walked past. There he goes. There he goes. Yep. <laughs> Bless you. Bless you. Yeah. Um, I gotta go and be a mommy now. And I have to go home and take pictures. Yes. Definitely. 
I pet the cat for me. Yes, my little cat. Oh, little pet cat. Yeah, I'm gonna go. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs>